what's up guys how's it going it is Matt here so today I'm gonna to be talking a little bit about clock issues all right so a little bit about clock issues and a mod that I uh, you know I kind of re recommend especially people like me with slightly bigger hands than usual um, basically it's like this uh, when I was at six hour Academy um, I did about an eight hour course and I was there for eight hours and I was basically shooting pretty much the entire time and when I was done I'll show you a little picture which will show up right about here you can see that my clock slide was all bloody and my thumb was all ripped up so I had that nice little clock finger alright so I'll clock finger you get right there now that happens now this is clear all right? that happens when the slide is racking back like this okay and if you're holding a high forward pistol grip like this and you have big hands like me then what happens is it cuts the heck out of your hand and you're bleeding by the time you're done so I was looking for a way to remedy that to take care of that now Glock Gen 4, Gen 5, they come with back straps. Right? So you put back straps on and some have the actual beaver tail set up on it and some are just plain Jane Glock back straps. So I tried the beaver tail one and it just didn't work for me. It still was cutting my finger up and it just didn't feel right in my hand. Um, my hands are not huge but they're a little bit bigger than your average person. So I was like what the heck's going on? There's got to be some way I can figure this out. So I did a little bit of research onto it and it led me to Ken Hackathorn. Go figure. Ken Hackathorn, Reed Hendricks for another per good person to, to uh, you know follow. And they led me to what's called the Grip Force Adapter. So I looked it up, I looked up the Grip Force Adapter, and I found it. So I went to this place called NDC Performance, okay, it's, I got them through eBay, but NDC Performance are out here in uh, Connecticut, believe it or not, over in Wallingford, and within a day, overnight, I got my Grip Force Adapters. So what a Grip Force Adapter is, I take a look here, this is a Grip Force Adapter. Now you notice, it's it's not like your average back straps that come to it, with like the actual uh, Beaver Sale back straps. It's actually about half the size. So this is actually the aggressive one that comes with two. Um, there's a smooth one, there's an aggressive one. This, you know, this is only like 20 bucks, like literally only 20 bucks to get these things. So it comes with two, it comes with the pins that you put it on there. But basically what it does, if you notice, it's a little bit wider, okay? It's a little bit wider on the back here. And the way how this sets up is it actually changes the angle of the gun. So a lot of people don't like the actual Glock for angle. They prefer like kind of a 1911 angle, so when you're putting, pointing it out there, um, they prefer that kind of a 1911 angle where it's naturally pointed. Now if you know Glock for any period of time, when you put your hand out, you literally got to put your wrist down a little bit because the angle of it to get it on target that's just designed like that. Now when you put the grip force adapter on, unlike the back straps that it comes that go all the way down, Actually, keep in mind, you can't put a plug in. I like having a plug for uh, load mags in. Uh, you're loading a mag, you put it in there, you don't have a plug, sometimes you get caught there, so I like having a little bit of a plug in there. But you can't put a plug on when you have the standard back straps. And on top of that, what it does is it keeps the Glock angle and it just goes all the way down. Now, with the Grip Force adapter, it doesn't, it is different. It's a little thicker here and it and it gets thinned out, narrows down. So what it does is, believe it or not, it puts it more of a naturally pointing angle, which makes it more like a 1911 grip angle. So when I present my firearm, when I pull up and present my firearm, the sights are lined up exactly where I need to be. That front sight isn't high like it usually is. It's actually right where it needs to be. Um, with the standard grips, the sight, believe or not for me the standard grips when you put it out there that front sight is just a little bit high so I needed something that could remedy that and that at the same time would help with the grip you know help with the little Glock thumb that you got so therefore I found the grip force adapter and I'm telling you what guys I am loving it because now like I said I keep my thumb up in the same angle that it would be here when this comes back it does not catch my thumb at all it does not catch my thumb at all my thumb is actually a good slides back so you get an angle on it a good way back so I have a thumb grip so it doesn't come back and it doesn't dare open my thumb anymore so that's a big deal for me because I love shooting a Glock's a good gun but the biggest complaint that I've always had with a Glock besides the fact that they're not perfection unfortunately they're good guns they're not perfection is that because of the low bore axis, the hardcore, I mean there's low bore axis and there's clock low bore axis. Because of that low bore axis, it does cut the hell out of your thumb, especially when you have a good solid thumb forward grip. So, like I said, I looked it up. Grip Force Adapter is the way to do it. I went to NDC Supply. Guys, go check them out. NDC Z Performance. Okay, NDZ Performance out here in Walford, Connecticut. And they sent me the Grip Force Adapter. Alright, and I'm happy with it. I'm going to take it out shooting here eventually and get a feel for it. And so, but so far, where it stands right now, I've been doing a little bit of testing. Perfect, uh, perfect. It, it, the slide does not come back into my thumb anymore, and it does a better grip. So when I'm doing the dry fire practice, I present it and I bring it up there. Guess what? So my sights are dead on instead of me having to adjust it and shift my sights, my front sight down a little bit. So I'm digging it already. So go check it out, guys. If you're having that same issue that I had, that Glock thumb issue, and you don't like that slight grip angle of a Glock, go find yourself Grip Force Adapter, guys. Uh, they work. It comes with two. 
Um, they actually have it for different models. They have the Gen 3 one, they have the Gen 4 and Gen 5 one. So you have to make sure you have the right one. They have it for different models. So just go look it up. And there's a lot of places that, support that, that will send one out to you. For me, I, I, th I think I found my new place. And that's going to be NDC Supply or Performance. There you have it, guys. If you like this video, like, share, subscribe. Tell your friends about me. And remember, guys, it's our responsibility to take care of each other and protect each other. Peace.